Cancer. Let's see. What's February gonna be like for my Cancer? Nope. Oh. Ten of Cups reverse. Oh no. That's not good. Seems like there's a separation or a divorce of somewhere you saw your future. What's crossing you? Let's see. All right. Main energy, three of swords, feeling heartbroken, cancer. You're waiting for judgment to be delivered. And when it comes to this juggling situation, your main situation right now is the Ten of Cups reverse. You're feeling like everything is destroyed right now and you're doing your best to keep uh, patient in the situation. Temperance. Temperance crossing the Ten of Cups. Your main energy right now is change. Everything's about change. You're changing. You're seeing things change out around you. Everything is... Your whole mood is about change. You really feel like something needs to change. Something shaking up your world and... It doesn't feel like it can go back to what it was. In the recent past, you may have had a chance at marriage, the Hierophant. Uh, it seems that there's some kind of court issue or something like that. Some official business that may have to be done in a court building, government building or something like that. That's the word I'm looking for. Your main focus right now is the fool. You want to try something new, Aries Energy. You want to try something new and you want to throw caution to the wind. You don't want to be scared of a result. You don't want to be paralyzed by fear. You want to just go straight into the new thing and not worry about the consequence because you're feeling confident with your own energy right now. What you're thinking about yourself is the sun. You're thinking to yourself about the sun. You're happy. Everything is feeling good. Life, you're feeling good about life. That's how you're feeling right now, Cancer. Ace of Cups. What are people saying about you is Ace of Cups. People are thinking that you're in love. You're so in love. Which is funny because it seems like your situation here is the Ten of Cups reverse. And what people say is about you is the Ace of Cups. It seems like you're happy to be separated from someone. You're, you're happy to feel in love because you're feeling the sun. Who gets a divorce and is happy about it? It's like... Something hit hit you and, and you're happy about this change with the death card in here. And you know what? It's funny. You think of yourself as the sun on the bottom of the deck three of swords. It's like in one scene you have a heartbreak and but on the inside you're you're happy actually. You're something about you feels free in this. Alright. Your advice right now is the five of wands. It may be to Avoid conflict, right? You don't want to tell too many people about this. Maybe it seems like already a lot of people are involved. So you may want to just weigh your words with them. Just try not to tell anyone your next move, right? That's the main, main thing. And right now the outcome is the star. It seems that maybe something that is at a distance... Something that's at a distance to you might be... You're hopeful in achieving it, right? You're actually feeling, um, you're feeling very clandestine about it. You know, you're feeling serendipity. That, that is what we could say. Okay, the Ten of Cups reverse is clarified by the Hermit reverse. That's telling me, like, you don't really see this separation as a loss that you've had because you're in a better spiritual place now because of it. The other situation was making you more spiritually deprived and depressed, possibly. Possibly you were wallowing in your depression. Was crossing temperance. Three of Pentacles upright. It seems like your support system right now is the one telling you to just chill out. Your support system, the people that equally, mutually invest in you are telling you to relax. Bottom of the deck, you got the Six of Cups. Five of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. Well, there is a lot of love in your life right now, Cancer. A lot. Who knows what's really even going on here? Okay. So you might be getting, uh, you might be getting help in staying patient from your family, or it could be your cousins. It could be anybody close to you that there is our mutual agreement, and 
discourse between you. Like, for example, it's people you trust with their opinion. You trust them, right? You value their opinion, they value your opinion. You know, you scratch your back, they scratch yours, basically, right? In your recent past, no, the, the third, third position is your thoughts, right? You're stalking somebody or somebody stalking you. During your change, you've come across some kind of information or maybe you've been reading a lot, you've been, you've been searching a lot of things, trying to get information about certain things. What's that about? I found the page of swords. What is cancer stalking? Nine of pentacles, someone single and prosperous. Oh, okay. It looks like you're making your next move towards possibly an earth sign. Or someone who's stable. Three of Cups Reverse came for that? Wow. Someone you feel... It's a friend of yours that you feel disconnected from. That's what it's telling me. Alright. Let's see here. The Empress on the bottom now. Clarifying the two... Uh, the Hierophant, you have the two of wands. In your recent past, there was a decision towards getting married. And you had two choices. You were leaning towards one more than the other. Is that how it ends? <laughs> the Empress on the bottom, Knight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. Seems like <laughs> you had a decision to make and even just having those choices, just having those options made you feel like the Empress, right? <laughs> yeah, I know that this is a cancer reading for sure now. All right. Your focus is the Fool card, remember? But what's with that is the strength. You know what you're going to do. You, ha you are fully confident in your next decision, Cancer. It feels like that. You're fully confident in it. Can I find the two of swords in your near future? You have the page of wands. It seems like you might send out a message soon or you're thinking about it um, concerning maybe a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It took a lot of emotional decision. It, it took a lot of emotional decision making, but it seems like you might send a light message of passion towards somebody. The sun. What's making you feel the sun? Nine of Wands. Seems like you're going to be giving something another chance. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Strong Leo energy here. Seems like you're going to be giving something another chance. Ace of, Ace of Cups. King of Swords. Someone who was very logical to you. And it feels like you're falling in love with them. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone who had told you something you didn't want to hear, basically. Five of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune. All right, avoid over-socializing, but this Wheel of Fortune is here for you. And it might be in something that somebody who's fighting against you. It might be someone who is dissing you or insulting you or your person. It might be someone who says something bad to you. It could be a moment of patience you find in that, right? might give you the brand new idea you've been looking for or a brand new scheme. It might be someone's insult towards you or maybe someone gossiped about you. It might be in that moment that you get your next big break. So you might want to watch out for that, Cancer. And it seems that things might be a little crazy because clarifying the star, we have the tower. It might be that Maybe the message you send ain't gonna come across the way you might like. Uh, it might lead to another fight. Who knows? It seems like there's another tower moment waiting for you to happen. But remember something. Remember something right now. We're gonna clarify the tower too, as a matter of fact. Just because, you know, no one likes to end a reading on the tower. But sometimes you should just let it rock like that. But I'm not gonna let that happen this time because I genuinely, I genuinely want to know what's up with this tower because I'm a cancer too and... You know, cancer is important to me. <laughs> Let me see right now. Let me get three cards to the tower. Oh, that's two. Nine of King of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and Seven of Wands upright. Someone's going to be defensive about finances right now, or it seems something like that. And it might cause someone to alienate themselves with the Four of Swords on the bottom. Um, it's going to be a fight about stability, and it might be one person over the other getting defensive seven of wands king of pentacles knight of pentacles someone's gonna feel insecure 
about an offer or maybe this could be you right it could be uh maybe you come in with a page energy and you end up becoming defensive that just might be how it might go you know you never know because your energy towards your person was a page you know you might maybe they're not looking for a page maybe they're maybe there were a knight of pentacles and now they're coming off as the king of pentacles and you're still reaching out to them as a page. So you might want to think about that. Just say. Alright, let's grab my cancer. A whisper. <laughs> let's grab my cancer. A whisper of love. Or ten. I mean, it looked like you wanted ten there. <laughs> cancer. Looked like you wanted ten there. I know I want 10. Yeah, I want shit. I want 10,000. Let's grab cancer. Oh, it's <laughs> Romance. Lavish the one you love with personal attention and affection. Alright. Bye.